Hi, good evening, Vanakam. Um, I really don't know whether I should be speaking in English or Tamil, because I'm sure there are a lot of people from different parts of this country. So I would speak to English, but all I would like to say this evening is, it just takes a moment, just a moment to help someone. So much of busy lives we have. We travel, we, have, we don't even know in today's fast world what our neighbors are doing. Gone are the days, gone are the days when I was brought up in a locality where all the doors used to be open and we would be running in and out of, out of different houses. Mom knew that we are in one of those houses and all we had to do is come back. There's a deadline and we need to be back at that hour. Gone are the days when we don't, uh, you know, where we don't know what our neighbors are doing. Today you asked me what my neighbor is doing. I said, I really don't know. I need to call up and ask her. All of us are so busy with our own world, the world which we have created. Today we talk about the best of education for the people we love, for our children, the best of everything in this world for us, for ourselves. The best of clothing, the best of travel, the best of amenities, the best of facilities, but that's all for us. Us as a small world, we have created for ourselves. Us never includes a child on the street. Us never includes a woman who is in need of money. Us never includes what the other person might be thinking about us for he needs a help. We need to expand this world of ours which we call us. We need to expand a little and understand that they might need a little help from us, from our world, which is going to bring a huge drastic change into their world. Including them, especially the children, because we always say children are the future of this country, of this world. So the children need education, everything can come next. But if you have an education, you have the world at your feet. Yes, there have been few examples where people probably have not had a degree in their hand, but they have great, made great mark in this world. They have they've made, uh, made themselves to be something who are extraordinary. We all know about Dhirubhai Ambani, we all know about Sachin Tendulkar, we all know about Bill Gates, we all know about Albert Einstein. But then we cannot forget that Dhirubhai Ambani made sure that his children are very well educated. Sachin Tendulkar makes sure that his children are very well educated. And so on the rest of the world. Education is a must. I tell my children, it's a must. You need to understand what you are being taught in school. Education is not about copying it from the book and writing it. But you need to understand what they teach you. And if you have that understanding, it's going to take you very far and it's going to help you to protect yourself and guard yourself from the different kinds of problems life throws at us. Life has to be taken lightly. Life is not to be taken seriously. But taken to be taken seriously when it needs. And in needs like this, we need to take it a little seriously when we say that if not spending a little money over a dinner, not spending little money over a holiday, not spending a little money in buying huge toys for our children, that money can be given towards the education of a child. We need to bring in this change. So I basically feel that the girl child especially because the amount of problems that still cripple our country when it comes to a woman, it's very important that the foundation is laid at the base when she is very young. And a strong foundation needs to be built for a girl child especially. Let's expand the world. Let's think beyond our worlds. Let's think beyond our loved ones. Let's just take the world to a better place and let us be in that journey 
which is going to take us into a better place along with the other people who might be strangers today but tomorrow they will be someone who you never know from where are going to turn around and help you a small gesture a small help a small smile a small hug a small help to the needy at the right time is going to take us a long way and above everything else you know the kind of immense satisfaction happiness joy it gives us is something out of this world i say this because i have sponsored a girl i have been associated with world vision for a very very long time i have always been the silent uh, donor because i do not like to come forward but then there are times when i need to come out of my cocooned life my self imposed uh, to be a silent donor and come out to this world and say that i can do it and so can you i mean it's very easy for people to say that you have money you can do it but if there's a will there is a way it is not about money it's about if you have the will you can do it so i'm here today just to say try and i'm sure you'll find a way to educate a child i'm sure you'll find a way to help someone who needs you and that is something we need to bring it's like a chain you help one that person will help the second and the second will help the third so we just form a chain where we say that i am here and it goes on and on and on and we form a long beautiful chain where we stay connected we may be far away but somewhere or the other we stay connected with each other not necessarily we have to know you and that is something we need to bring it's like a chain you help one that person will help the second and the second will help the third so we just form a chain where we say that i am here and it goes on and on and on and we form a long beautiful chain where we stay connected we may be far away but somewhere or the other we stay connected with each other not necessarily we have to know each other but then you know that there's some karmic connection somewhere where you can come together to save this country to save this world and save the future of the children of this country who i very very strongly feel that they need to stand on their own two feet to face the problems and face the diversities and face this world with a lot of challenges so all i would like to say is open your palms open your heart open your mind and do the best you can i'm doing the best to my capabilities you do your best to your capabilities the ups and downs we are not going to measure it that how much i donated how much you donated we donated we made it we made a difference and that's all it's going to take and make a difference to this world and this country thank you very much jafar sadik from santom